Hey guys, Aqua GTX here. And quick thing before I start, you might hear my brother in my background. He likes to make noises, so just don't mind if, if he's right there. But today I'll show you how to make a Five Nights at Freddy's game in PowerPoint. So, first thing I always like to do is make a new folder. And then you can call it anything like, I'll call mine Five Nights at uh, Stick Figures. Oh, oh, oh. There you go. So, when you make your folder, first thing I like to do is make an another folder called Night One. You should make thing make everything organized, or else you know it'll be confusing for you. So, Night One, new PowerPoint presentation. It can be any version. 2013 up and re recommended. Five Nights at Stick Figures, Night One. Or if you want, maybe put in brackets, night one. Double click it. First thing you want to do is close this. First thing you want to do, click under new slide and click blank. So every time you create a new slide, it'll be blank. And, and go to transitions, click this, and click apply to all. And there's a, there's a glitch that sometimes happens. I always save afterwards because. There's a glitch where uh, sometimes if I save, it just closes the program without saving. So that's not really good, so I always save. And it might close. So what I do, I grab a square, resize it, make it black, click text, click out the box. Because look, if you, don't, if you click in the box, it'll enable this thing. So look, again, click, I put it to here, it won't work. So it has to be outside the box. Then right here, Choose your color, white be is best, and any font. It doesn't really matter, but if, le if you can at least read it, then that'll be great. I always use this font called Rockwell. It's like one of my favorite ones. Position it and call it your title: Five Nights at Stick Figures. Nice, lovely. Resize it. Okay, that's too much. Fifty-four is pretty good, in my opinion. And what I do? Grab this, copy and paste it, type new game, resize to around like 44 or whatever size, doesn't matter. Hang on, let me just position it, that's nice, nice, nice. And you can add extras or something, but I'm going to add it just a continue here. And a little feature, if you want to make something called exit game, all you do, you put it, if you position it, click insert, Action, mouse click, hyperlink to uh, end show. And what will it do? What we'll do when you click it, it finishes the slide. But I think that's pointless. You can just press escape, and they'll do the same thing. So um, then, what we're gonna do is you can e if you can either find an image of your character or make your own. I'm just gonna hang on, create my own. Give me a second. There you go. All right. Then, I recommend at least two or more characters. There you go. So, they're the little two guys. Color the other one. I'll color it purple. Alright. Nice. They're looking good. And another, th like th th another little thing I like to do. Let's do this. FNAF. Uh, Scott. Cawthon. Cawthon is how you say it. Oh god, I can't even spell. Res resize it? Okay, that's too, too much. And put. And whatever the game is called, so Five Nights S, S Stick Figures, so it'll be FNS. And your name. There you go. And even more credits or anything doesn't really matter. And if you see this little 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 tip, if you see this little red line under and you hate it, you can right click on it and click ignore all. It's a little slow thing, but it just gets rid of it. Boom. Not fans. <laughs> Stupid score to correct. Yeah. So save, yeah. So then what I do you can add a newspaper, but mm, not my thing. So copy the background. And then click the middle, choose a font again. I recommend keeping the same font because, you know, it will look confusing if you use different fonts. 
Yeah, my dad's home. He might come in. I don't know. Okay. So you can do a little special effects. So dissolve. I like using dissolve. Put it onto one. Look at this. Yay. Uh, new game. Uh, guys, give me one second. I have to stop recording. Hey, guys, back. Just had to deal with something. Oh, okay. I was here. So we're building on clicking on this button. And I'll take you to this slide. So, new game. Action. Mouse click. Hyperlink to. You can do mouse over, but you can might you might make a mistake quickly doing a mouse over, so I'll do mouse click. Hyperlink to. And then I know you can do next slide, but But if you do next slide, okay, look, I'll show you something. If I do next slide, there's nothing I'm gonna show you guys. You click this, take your next slide. But if you make a mistake somewhere and you put a new slide here and you click new game, we'll just end up like this. But if I click new slide, new if I do new s if I don't do next slide, it's way better because look. If I do slide two, there you go, that'll work, right? But if you put something in the middle, boom, it'll take you. It will actually connect us and it will say slide three. Little neat feature. Maybe when you're building the cameras, it'll be better to not do it because it'll because it'll be quicker. But look, little cool feature. Then we click, go to transitions, click after, slide three. Wait, guys. Sorry, I'm back all over again. Everything's going out of hand. But we're also going to work on the office. So we could test it out. Five nights of stick figures. If I click new game, it takes me to this. Pretty cool. I showed you after three seconds. Should take around three seconds to read this. Then home, new slide, and I'm sorry, we're gonna build an office. So I'm gonna resize this. Um, sorry guys, wait, can you wait another minute? Okay, so so here, here's the office, and uh, um, you can you can use a gif of a fan. That's what I'm gonna use. It's a pretty cool idea. This make sure it's shorter and boom and do this. So click on one, press shift, and then click on the other ones. Let go shift, click shape fill, brown. You can do brown outline too. By uh, actually yeah, brown outline that's a pretty good idea. And then same thing, click shift and click all of them. Arrange group. So look. You can resize it now if you made a mistake or something. And when you see this little, when you see this little line come up, this red line, that means it's centered. So if we cl click sh slideshow, it's centered. Now go on Google. Oh, I got that. FNAF GIF. Uh, I mean, fan GIF. Yeah, look, you can see I've done it already. So you can get this one or something, but that's unoriginal. You can get this one. Or th this one, but I like to use this one. I like to use this one, but I, like I love to use this one. Co you know, you shouldn't know how to copy and paste, but here we go. Copy and paste it. You can design however you want, it doesn't matter. So, there we go. Boom. So now, it's, this is a GIF. PowerPoint does support GIFs, so you get this lovely little cool fan thing. And you can add a little drink or something like. Uh, Coke, cola, PNG or something. But I'm gonna go with my favorite drink, Dr Pepper. Yeah, best drink ever. There, something like this. Or put like a be that American soda in a. Oh, what's that little thing in a in a cup, PNG? I don't know what it is. Something like this. Yeah, yeah, this. But yeah, very American soda. Excuse me. Sorry. Um, so you go put it here. And to give this more life, you can make your own poster or get one off the internet. I'm gonna make my own poster here. So uh, it may be boring, but I can give you guys an idea how to make your own poster. So, so let's say.
<laughs> right, here we go. Want to have fun? Sorry, no fun here. Just, just stupid joke, I don't know. And like, like the table, group it, it's just so you can move it around if you want. Nice. So now, what we've just done is given this more life, but there's something missing, and it's just, maybe you could just, just, just try, like, you can do whatever you want, just try give it as much decoration so the player doesn't get bored looking at the same uh, goddamn office. Um, I guess so, that's it, yeah. Maybe to give it even more decoration, actually, you can make some wires coming out or something like this. Should I make it thicker? I might make it thick. Yeah, look. Uh, red. Red. Go over. And blue, actually, make it blue this time. There you go. So now we've just added some wires. Uh, oh, even more. This looks so great here. Yeah, okay, it doesn't always have to be like this, but if you're gonna give it an old look, lovely idea. So now, like, you're thinking, hey, where's the doors? No, no, the animatronics can come in. Well, I've, in my opinion, I've got one of the really good solutions. So you could just add a door here, which is actually a pretty good idea. Just slap on a door. Slap on the door, like this. Actually, before we do a door, uh, build this. This just give me one second, and and for good measures, measure a stick figure, and grab the door, measure them their height, so you don't have to edit it when you uh, start to create it. There you go. That's how big the door is. And then what I'm gonna do is add a door button, and this is like Five Nights at Candy's. Uh, you'll see the eyes through the door, and you'll use a button. You'll use a button to uh, close the door. So it's a nice, big fat red button. Another thing I, ne I actually forgot to do is add this. There you go. Yes, now you got that time up here. So we have night one. Nice. So look, look how much a this is a bit more atmosphere added. You know, you can add two doors, but you can remove that post, move or remove that. But for now, it's gonna be one door here. So um. We're gonna copy the slide, copy so control C, control V. Or you can do copy and paste not by right clicking on it, but it's quicker doing control C, control V. Now to we're gonna do a closed door effect. So click on like a dark colour. Not not completely black, it'll look like it's opened. Like this or something. And then copy and paste it. Then and only only move down the top, not the sides. And make it any colour you want, doesn't matter. Uh now I'll make it like lovely orange colour. So now that it looks like the door's closed, you can and also for extra effect if you want to do this, you can even add a, a window to the door. So maybe you can see the uh I'm animatronic, yeah. You know what? Boom. But I don't like that. So it's a little closing door. Now what I'm gonna do, insert, action, mouse click, hyperlink to slide four. And for extra what I like to do, click play sound. Uh don't have any sound effects yet, maybe in the next episode I'll change it, but for now it's gonna be a basic click. But next episode I'll definitely change it to like a for now for uh, door closer a sound effect. But we got click. <coughs> Boom. So here, oh no no. So you can I don't know if you can hear the click but it's working here. So look, here we go. Five nice stick figures. New game. Twelve AM first night. We go got so you got a little door. Oh look, close the door. Boom. Okay, I wanna open it. Basic, but it's good enough for a start, you know, we all gotta start somewhere and if you're not best at designing Maybe just contact me on this video and maybe I'll help you out. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Goodbye.